Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Marky B with Eclipse Lawn Care. We got another lawn that we're about to uh, knock out real quick. And we're here. We're actually trying to, I'm trying to knock out all my lawns before we get hit by the rain. It's definitely cloudy. We got a little bit of showers earlier today. So I had to kind of delay and wait for a bit. But this is the uh, lawn that we're about to knock out real quick. <clears throat> It looks like uh, I'm going to have to probably be careful. I'll probably have to rake that over to the neighbor's yard there just because I don't want to get my mower trying to chop up some of these twigs and sticks and whatnot. But this yard is fairly, uh, I guess, uh, not overgrown. But we just do, we have a lot of uh, debris falling from the trees, sticks and stuff like that. So I'm going to move those out of the way. Let's go check out the backyard let me go ahead and uh, hit the alarm there or the lock system so it's not looking too bad these shrubs definitely need to come out but let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, backyard so we're gonna mow this section as well all of this mulch up some of these leaves it's really not too bad a little scraggly but not overgrown this isn't a overgrown video per se backyard is looking okay backyard is usually uh, overgrown now that's overgrown that's way overgrown so let's go ahead and take a little look see back here and uh not too bad so we'll just go ahead and uh definitely gonna need some uh trimming on the side and we got we don't got that much scraggler just this is probably the only one looks like we'll leave that there and we'll just mow it down all right let's see if we can't prop up this gate keep it from closing on us what this bridge will do right here there we go all right, so we're going to use the skag. We're going to be able to use the skag both front and back. That gate is just barely wide enough for us to get the skag in the back. Love me the skag. And then, of course, we'll use the Echo 225 to do the edging and weed eating. Which, uh, this yard has really never had a lot of good grass growing right here in the on the sidewalk part or around the tree there it's always been bare for the most part and uh you know there's really not an edge especially here i know you guys are going to say hey you're using the string trimmer that's why you got that gap now it's been there because uh grass never grows there so let's go ahead and uh set up i'm going to give you guys a point of view footage of the uh of me cutting the grass here but we're gonna have, we gotta rake this up and uh, move it out of the way first
got it all done. So customer customer wanted me to come out here and try to mow before uh, it started to rain. So we went ahead and knocked this one out, guys. Use a 32 skag to knock out the uh, front yard here. Looks pretty pretty dang cool. Speaking of pretty dang cool, it's actually nice and cool today. Lots of clouds. We're supposed to get some rain on and off. We've been getting a little sprinklage here and there. So we got a mix of Bermuda and St. Augustine. Bermuda on the other side, St. Augustine here right under the tree. Dead shrubs. Let's go take a look at the backyard and see what we got there. Looks nice and cut as you guys were able to see the uh, point of view. Speaking of uh, point of view, guys, please uh, subscribe, like, and uh, comment below. Let me know uh, what you guys think of the uh, skag so far. This is the backyard. Looks nice and luscious. Pretty. St. Augustine back here looks fantastic maybe left a little rut here yeah i think there's where i turned around well it looks it looks like it's been bare got another rut there maybe i did it maybe not who knows y'all guys uh let me know in the comments uh did i leave that rut there yes or no maybe maybe not i'm gonna say i didn't but uh you guys might say i did let me know in the comments alley looks uh decent there's fairly a lot of uh, debris i think the neighbor whenever they mow their alleyway they don't blow the grass they just kind of leave it there in the uh, in the alley so and then we got a puddle of water right there in the middle of the alley too so a lot of that grass kind of got stuck and got accumulated there so let's see uh once again that's the yard, that's the uh, aftermath. And I think we're ready to uh, get out of here onto my next property. Hopefully we'll be able to knock out the majority of my properties for the week. Today, that is my goal. According to the uh, weather, we're supposed to get rain all week here in By the Joe Dallas area. Days. Here in the Dallas area, so hopefully we get that uh, taken care of because i'm ready to go to the gie expo next week all right guys we'll see you guys on the next video peace out